This anime was the most hilarious comedy anime to me among all the others. You might say that there are other anime that are better than this, but that's just your opinion, and this is mine. Grand Blue is an anime that's supposed to be about diving and comedy. But it's mostly comedy and honestly it does its job pretty well as a comedy anime. Every single episode had me burst out in laughter. I enjoyed every moment of watching it, but there are some flaws however. Once you get sucked into Grand Blue's themes, you'll find love with this show. From the adult humor to the numerous character gags, it's an anime that plays with itself. It's a summer sensation. Iki in her daily life as she struggles to lose weight. From there on we are introduced to a bunch of unique characters and Also I can't praise the opening song of this anime enough. It's way too much wholesome, it's so good that it will liven up anyone's mood. Overall this is an anime with hilarious comedy, fan service, exercise, and most of all, surprisingly it's educational. Yes. Oga, one day he encounters a man floating down the river. After rescuing him, the man splits down the middle to reveal a baby, which crawls onto Oga's back and immediately forms an attachment to him. Though he doesn't know it yet, this baby is named Kaiser de Emperana Beelzebub IV, or Baby Beel for short, the son of the Demon Lord. As if finding the future Lord of the Underworld isn't enough, Oga is also confronted by Hildegard, Beel's demon maid. Together they attempt to raise Baby Beel. Beelzebub is a genuinely funny anime. As you can probably tell from the synopsis, Beelzebub is a show that doesn't take itself too seriously, and this approach works very well for the story being told. Overall it's a really good mix of action and comedy. Honestly, when I started watching this anime, I thought it was another cute girls doing cute things type of anime but it was actually the total deconstruction of the cute girls doing cute things at its finest. And I say this, as someone who really enjoys slice of life anime, there's no complex storytelling, and a show like this knew what it was doing from the very start. The opening song in this anime was however pretty misleading. From the very start, we are introduced to the trio of main cast, who are three girls. They make up the heart and soul of this show as every episode deals with their daily live adventures. Together, they are the Pastimers Club. As the most energetic girl of the group, Hanako often gets her classmates into playing games at school. These games often ends up being formulated with outrageous rules and ideas. Overall this is a very fun anime to watch. Anime literally describes what this show is all about, the daily lives of high school boys. No it's not about cute boys do cute things, but it's about a group of school boys do what they do best such as slacking off in a friend's house, pranking on people, talking about girls, telling random stories and any other things in exaggeration manners. This is a gag-based anime much like Nichiju its girl's counterpart. The format is also similar, every episode of this series is composed of several random short skits which usually are not connected to each other. Each skit focuses on a slapstick humor with a punchline at the end. I personally found most of them hit the mark while others are predictable. Overall, it's a comedy anime like no other, daily lives of high school boys had me laughing throughout the whole anime. At 12 episodes in length, it promises that you will enjoy every single moment. On a comedy anime with one of the most badass and cool main character, then this anime is for you. Our main character Psyche has psychic abilities and he's like a god who can do anything with his powers. But despite all of that, he always wants to lead a normal life. But that certainly never happens with him because of the people around him. In conclusion, The Disastrous Life of Psyche K is a very original and hilarious comedy anime, full of lovable characters that will make you laugh from start to end. If you're a fan of comedy anime, 
make sure to watch this one. And if you aren't, I still heavily recommend you to give it a try because it's probable that it will greatly surprise you. Thank you.